give the order. He wants the oh. order. If that's contagious, as the Mushmaster roars. I'm drinking? Not oh. anymore. And you know what we mean by top guy, right? World Championship. Keep Tim Sprint up there! Diego Cruz locked horns with, but I don't know if he's ever been in there oh. with a killer. Look at that, wasting no time. Diego obviously did his homework, guys. He knows that he is in there with a killer, and he looked to make that first move. He got that first strike in. May have taken the Mushmaster out of his element, off his game. Oh, look at that, though. That takedown by the Mushmaster hitting the ropes, oh. and a forearm to the the kidneys and the spleen. You know, he may be uh, having some red in his toilet bowl tomorrow with that kidney body work, Sean. I'll tell you what, a man like Spriggs knows all the pressure points. He puts so much into that shot in the lower lumbar region. Diego Cruz is hurting right now. He's paying the price. Diego, of course, it would appear, watched the tapes, did his homework. But like we say, Everybody has a plan till they get hit in the mouth, or in this case, a forearm shiver to the kidneys and lumbar spine. Is he drinking? Not oh. anymore! Is he drinking? He may be, but he just had to swallow that champagne the hard way and possibly swallow his words. Look at Diego, the fire and passion coming out in living color. Whoa, oh my goodness. There's nothing for it. Again into the lower lumbar region, that lower back. Did you see how he just cut him short, did Tim Spriggs, grabbed that waist lock. Looked like he was going for a, a, a sort of a, a high and tight belly to back suplex or a waist lock suplex, but then he dropped him right over the knee. Again, like you said, Cradle, working that lumbar spine. Tim Spriggs, he is a master of joint manipulation and he knows exactly how to break down his opponent every which way, whether it be by submission or as you saw, just by the strikes, dropping him over his knee, any way to bend his opponent in unnatural ways. Hard right fist, a little, a little stank on it, a little, what would you call it? Playtime for the Bushmaster. And I, again, I, I think it's a huge mistake to try to count out Diego Cruz at any juncture. Absolutely, Diego Cruz, he's been, over the past few years, he's been more of a tag team wrestler. But tonight, he is in there as a single star, and he can pull off what, the impossible, honestly, exactly the impossible. what most would call a miracle, what that could do for his career here in MCW. Look at this, just brutality in its most basic form. Knees, elbows, strikes. Oh, there's that confidence. And there's nowhere to go for Diego as the Mushmaster aims and fires oh. with that high knee. You talked about joint manipulation. It's like when you, you get a rotisserie chicken and you peel off the wing, hold on the cover, two lackadaisical cover there by the Mushmaster, Sean. I'll tell you what, Diego Cruz beating down physically, he looks outside the ring. That's a beat down mentally. He's in big trouble here. And we'll see yeah. if Diego Cruz can get out of this. That's a great point. He's got to somehow go back to the game plan he came into this match with. Not only is he physically being decimated, physically intimidated, but you're right. You look to that outside, and it's no man's land. You're, you're, you're across enemy lines, my friend. And you will get no oh. quarter. Got dumped right in front of him. They, oh, look oh, at that. Look at him pick the bones. Taking no prisoners. Team Spriggs doing exactly the Mushmaster's bidding, doing exactly what they get paid to do. Yes, and that's, and that's what Tim Spriggs likes to see. He doesn't want to have to give the order. He wants the oh. order implied, oh. but nothing implied except nearly possibly the end of this matchup with that stalling German suplex. That was beautiful. Might be a new human suplex machine right here. I mean, he dumped Diego on the top of his head, on the back of his neck. Wow, look at that. Traditional waist lock takedown. 
This, this is just toying with Diego Cruz at this point. Oh, we're not a traditional Greco-Roman freestyle wrestling where points are granted and takedowns count. But that's the world that Tim Spriggs comes from, that mixed martial arts world. And that's what makes him so damn dangerous. And he, the, the scary part is he's only going to get better as he, as he transitions from BJJ to professional wrestling. He can add to his repertoire. It's only going to make him that much more dangerous. Lucky for Diego Cruz, he was able to avoid that knee. Rookie mistake there. You don't see many chinks in the armor of Tim Spriggs, but he went to the well again. Oh, look at those feet from Diego Cruz. Oh, spinning heel kick. On any given, any given event, one superstar can defeat another. Can he not, Creedle? Absolutely. All it takes is three seconds to get it done. And if Diego Cruz can execute this, he might be able to get it done. Wow, that was, I mean, he was trying to muscle up 230 pounds at Tim Spriggs. Smarter Spriggs, he got to the ropes, now he's on the floor. Brent, you had mentioned that Diego Cruz, he had done his homework. This is exactly oh. what he needs to do. Keep Tim Spriggs Look off out. Oh, goodness gracious. No warning, no warning shot. He was just in one full motion at the top and then attack. That's how you take out a crew. And now it is one-on-one. -on -one. Throwing his body into the fire, and it paid off. High risk, high reward. That's the jackpot oh, they talk about. Diego Cruz taking the fight to the entire champagne campaign. He's about to get some backup. Murmur. Techno. The equalizers. They're taking the hype out of the equation. And now the battlefield a little more even. Look, with the addition of Murmur and Techno, they have thinned the herd, and Diego Cruz looking for that opening on the Mushmaster. Oh, but moved out of the way. And he pivoted. Hold on oh. now. Caught him in that guillotine. That guillotine choke has put so many men out. Wow, he tapped. A valid effort, a valid effort, a valiant outing by Diego Cruz. But the story here is that the Bushmaster and his Champagne Campaign Team Spriggs still undefeated.